okay, so I just got back from the Reptile Show, um, or the Orlando Repticon. It was a really good show. I mean, I had a really good time there. I saw a lot of really nice people. Um, I did come back with a lot of snakes, which I'll show you at the end of the video. And I did come back, and, or, no, and <laughs> I'm sorry. I did get a milk snake in the mail, which I was going to do a video on that, but that was after I got my second COVID shot, and I was just feeling, like, really sick, so... Uh, I didn't get to make a video or post anything about that, but uh, I will post um, the snake in this video. It'll, it'll be in this video. So I came home with four snakes today, and that'll be the fifth one uh, that I got in the mail. Um, and, I'll, and I'll give shout-outs to all the breeders that I got it from. Um, and uh, the, the video won't be as big today because I had to leave early due to some family-related issues. So, um, But I did get a lot of nice footage. I did get a lot of stuff. Um, and uh, a little story about the Orlando Repticon. Uh, back then, back when I was like 10 years old, it used to be like a really huge show, and I'd always be super excited to go there. Uh, and then after uh, COVID, it got like um, smaller, or smaller, but like not like super small, like a Sarasota or a Melbourne show, but uh, like it got smaller. Um, but this time, this show was actually huge. It, it was back to its normal big, like big show. It was, it was a huge show. I've never seen a show that big before. Uh, and there was tons of corn snakes. I mean, usually shows I go to, there's corn snakes. Um, uh, depending on who's going there, there's corn snakes. But this show had a ton of them. So I, I got, uh, most of my footage I got is uh, of corn snakes. Uh, I did get a few ball pythons and a few lizards. But I did mostly corn snakes, milk snakes, colubrids, and stuff like that. Because um, that's that's main. That's my main channel. That's what I specialize in. So um, I, that's what I mainly got. But um uh, anyway, though, um, this will be my video uh, for the week. I'm not going to post um, on Tuesdays and Fridays anymore because I don't have a lot of content to post all the time. So I'll probably post, like, if there's a reptile show around, like, I'm in the Melbourne area, so if there's a reptile show around there, you can expect me to post a reptile show saying, like, 2021, uh, I don't know, Kissimmee Repticon. Which, actually, I am going to post. There's a Kissimmee Repticon in September, so I'm going to post a video on that, too. Uh, but I, I, will, I will still post, just not super often. And um, and I'll probably post videos on how-tos and stuff for certain snakes, like how to clean a snake out or how to, um, you know, how to feed a snake that's super picky or something like that, which I've already done a video on that. But, uh, you know, videos like that, you know, educational videos I'll be posting as well. Um... Uh, but other than that, that's about it. I hope you guys enjoy the video. If you do, please leave a like and subscribe, and I will see you after the footage. Uh, these are, uh, Motley is just a pattern gene, mom. It's not a color gene. Look at this one. Alright, I'm going to let you get up here. If we don't find them... Yeah, but someone's pretty. We'll go back to the other table. That's a story. Like, yeah, yeah, that's I can get a pair of Motley Gold Dust. Like, like, if I get lucky, I'll get some snows and snow stripes. Yeah, the butter and the gold dust look the same. I have almost everything that's either hit. Um, no hair at all. Or, um... They try color hog nose. Yeah. That is really great. Bob Lock. You don't see many of those no more. They're, they're each oh, like six different people. Okay. So yeah. And, no, I mean, because I mean, I had the original female, which is this one from Edisto Island. David. Oh wait, yeah, that's my David. Wow. But then I bred it with different. Right. Yeah. Different. I, I mean, I've had like six. So actually, the the mosaics I have are. Uh,
Alright, you want to touch a cool lizard? So those cropped up in captivity. Okay. Uh, gourmet, I think Gourmet wrote it was the first, first one, one that, that, yeah. that produced them. Nice. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we kept them in our bedroom. Thank you guys so much. Thank you. Throw them down. Yeah, and check us out on Facebook. I guess I'll film these because um, uh, I like carbon, so. Big that milk's like this, holy. Oh, look at those. Those are, um, oh, bearded dragons. I call them pancakes, though. It's on my phone, so there will be black lines. That's so cool. Huh? You didn't buy it yet. The white side is black. What was that? I thought we're in New York. Oh, yeah. I said. Thank you for watching. I hope you all enjoyed the video. If if you do, please leave a like and subscribe. And uh, please uh, check out Clyde Colubrids. He's a really great breeder. I actually met him there. Uh, I didn't film him, though, because I don't want to put a camera in his face. But um, please uh, do check him out. Check out his channel. He has a really good channel. And um, uh, we'll see you next time.